Hello everyone, my name is Sun from iSense USA. In this video, I would like to show you how to pair Kerasense N plus BT blood glucose monitor as well as troubleshoot uh, to your phone via Smart Log mobile application. It is important to download Smart Log mobile application, so please uh, go to your app store and download and install Smart Log. Uh, I have disabled my network on my phone so that I can uh, avoid receiving any push notification during making of this video. Uh, so it'll be a little bit slow for me, but it'll be much faster for you when you try this at home. So let's just jump right in. Uh, first step is really for those who have been trying multiple times and keep on failing and you wonder why. And this first step will definitely help you. So first of all, let's go to Smart Log. This is the main screen. Go to More on the bottom right corner. Second from the top, Accessories. You may or may not see this on your phone, but under register device, you'll see uh, Kerasense N plus BT. Uh, I want you to click that and delete this device. Press OK. Now, uh, let's go to your phone setting, which is generally this page here, uh, where you can go find a Bluetooth device list. If you see Kerasense N plus and four digits, it is very important to disable this or forget this device. So please do so. Now, this phone has no information about this meter whatsoever. So let's start the official process. So let's go to Smart Log. Again, the main page. Let's go to more on the bottom right corner. Second from the top accessories. Now scroll down to find Kerasense N plus BT. Uh, if you don't see this on the list, uh, it is important to update your app, which can also be found in more uh, option. Or you can also choose glucose meter parentheses ISINSE. Now, I'm going to use Kerasense N plus BT. Okay. Make sure you have Bluetooth function on on your phone. So tap register. Now from this screen, go to your meter. There is a down arrow button on the left-hand side. Press and hold that button for three seconds. And you will see this screen on your meter, which is BT and yes blinking. When you see yes blinking, there is a button on the right. I'm gonna call that power button. Press, click the power button once. And then you see number two on your meter. On your phone, let's go to next. One or two, choose two. Now we're gonna see search. Press search. And then you're gonna see Kerasense N plus four digits. Now that four digits is the last four digits of the serial number on the back of your meter. Click that. And then you'll see this screen. Uh, you're gonna press pair, which is we're not done yet. Press pair. When you see this screen, BT pair, yes, this is a very important step. When you see that screen, press power button. And then you just saw BT sync end. And this uh, shows up if you don't have any blood glucose data on your meter, you'll see this screen. If you do, you're going to see other uh, results on your phone. So now it is successfully paired and you can check that again by going to more accessories and then you'll see Kerasense N plus BT. Now for our device, I'm going to show you uh, the transfer of data. For our device, our Bluetooth uh, triggers when you measure the blood glucose and taking out of test strips. So I have a Kerasense N strip here. I'm going to insert that. After three seconds, you're going to see this uh, symbol to apply blood sample. I have a Lansing device and Lancets with me. Uh, you can twist this, insert, twist off the Lancet cap, put that on the side so that we can discard it later. Put back the Lansing device cap. You can adjust your depth. I usually go with three. Uh, you can see that the button is orange that means it's loaded. You can make sure by doing just uh, 
cocking back the uh, uh, the end of the lancing device. Gather your blood on the tip of the finger, press this button, and then squeeze some blood out. Very important, on the very tip of the test strip, you're going to apply blood sample. After five seconds, you're going to see the result. Now, again, like I said, when you take out the test strip, the data will transfer. So let me show you right here. Taking out the test strip, Bluetooth triggers, and then your glucose level has been updated. It has been transferred. Uh, more than welcome to fill out any other optional uh, cho uh, choices that you have made during or during or before or after of measuring blood glucose, or you can simply press save, and that's it. You see uh, 10.44 a.m. Pacific time zone, uh, 93 blood glucose level. So there it is. That's how you pair Kerasense N plus BT to your mobile application.